I think you might have taken these examples of personification. Now I will go for synecdoche. What is synecdoche? We'll see it now. This is the fourth one, S Y N E C D O C H E, synecdoche. In synecdoche, a part is used. to represent to represent a whole and the whole that is body to represent a part example he has many mouths to feed he has many mouths to feed i will underline mouths here so here a part mouth is used to designate designate the whole body designate the whole body the second example is india won the match against australia Australia here the whole India is used is used to designate designate a part
that is team here children you have to look to these two examples here which i have given synecdoche a part of the body is used to represent a whole and the whole body to represent a part for example he has many mouths to feed means he has many people in the house to feed them here mouth is used a part of the body to show the whole family here then a part of mouth mouth is a part of the body is used to designate the whole body here india won the match against australia means the whole india is used to designate a part a team we did not we instead of saying our indian team won against australia we say india won against australia so a part is used to designate the whole body this is synecdoche i will give some examples here on synecdoche these are four best examples important examples and are very necessary to learn them now i will give some examples i will rub this number 1 sweet little red red feet sweet little red feet why did you die so here it is concerned red feet means a small child is asking why did you die second one he desired he desired to draw forth draw forth the steel and let the blood and let the blood flow free and so to die see ya steel means sword he desired to draw forth the steel and let the blood flow free and so to die fourth one the third one all the best brains all the best brains in the country could not solve the problem the fourth one he manages to earn his bread
नंबर फाइव ही इज द न्यूटन ऑफ दिस सेंचुरी He is the Newton of his of this century. Number six. All the rank and the fashion. rank and the fashion came out to see came out to see the sight so these are the examples of synecdoche now children what you all do is you try to have more examples on personification and synecdoche that will be good for you all for your own revision tomorrow uh i will deal with some active voice and passive voice and uh, today this is all for you all